Hello everyone and welcome to this week's Game Development Log video diary and this week I've been working on buildings that you can enter. So over here in the farmyard area I've created the first enterable building which is this small hut over here. The first thing that I had to implement was doors that can open and you can see here that when I get close enough to the door of this hut I can open it like this. This also loads up the inside of the building so that I can go in and have a look around. When I go into the house obviously the roof disappears so that I can see what's going on inside and you can now see a few new furniture models which I've been working on this week like this hand painted bed model. And these entities are actually a little bit different from other entities because they can also exist in item form like the chair and the table in my inventory here. This means that you'll be able to buy or make these furniture items and then you can use them to customise the interior of your house like this. This whole house and furniture system is still so far away from being properly implemented though, I've really just thrown together the basics very quickly this week so that I can at least demonstrate it in the Kickstarter video, but I'll be spending many more months on this system in the future. So those were the only new features this week, but I also added a load of new models into the game again. So starting off in the new area that I added last week, there's this lovely new house model with a hanging lantern which looks really awesome. And there's also a mystical new creature roaming around near the lake. In the desert town there's another new house model which you can see here. And I've also scattered a few ore deposits around the world such as this one here in the hilly region. Eventually you'll be able to mine these to get gems or metal ores which you could then forge into weapons or armour or other stuff like that. But at the moment I've only added the model and the mining animation so you can't harvest any ores from them quite yet. As well as that I also created a couple of models for the capital city which I'm going to be making very soon, but for now I've just temporarily lined them up along the entrance to the usual town. So there's this very neat looking tree, and also this new statue model. In other news I moved to Germany last weekend and I'm currently staying with some friends in Wolfsburg, and then tomorrow I'm going to be moving to a new flat in Berlin. Unfortunately I'm not actually going to have proper internet access for a few weeks so I'm going to delay the Kickstarter campaign by one extra week just to make sure that I can get everything done in time. So it will now almost certainly start in exactly four weeks from today on the 4th of September. For this week though that is it! Next week I'm just going to be continuing to add more models and areas into the game and I'll also be doing the Q&A video as soon as I'm settled in the new flat. If you want to see some extra pictures and videos of development during the week then you can follow me on any of my social media pages, all of the links are in the description below. But yeah, thank you guys very much for watching this video, do subscribe if you haven't already, have a fantastic week, and I will see you all next time.